In Armonia Plus, loudspeakers play a crucial role in the design of a project, as they will contain all the preset information that is necessary for a correct amplifier operation. To add a loudspeaker to the workspace, we go under Design, Add, and then we click on the Speaker tool at the top bar. This will open a window with all the different loudspeaker manufacturers that we have saved in our library. We can select a manufacturer, then we select the family, which means picking from the different series of loudspeakers available for that same manufacturer. We can then select a model, and finally an application, which is simply the different practical uses available for the same loudspeaker. We can select, for example, 90Hz high pass filter, and then we can select the quantity of loudspeakers that we want to load onto our project. For this example, let's choose A loudspeakers, and then we can define if we want to wire these speakers in parallel. The speakers can be wired vertically or horizontally. And Harmonia Plus will also allow us to define how many loudspeakers we want to wire in parallel. It can be, for example, 2x2, 3x3, 4x4, and so on. Let's select 2x2, for example. Finally, Harmonia Plus gives us the option to already load these loudspeakers onto our project in an array group. And we can select if we want this to be a vertical or a horizontal array. Let's select vertical array for our A loudspeakers. Once we are happy with all our selections, we can click the Add button to add these loudspeakers to the workspace. We can then continue to add more loudspeakers to the workspace, or we can simply click Add and Close. And as we can see, we have added two array groups with A loudspeakers each to the workspace. We can then select one individual loudspeaker by clicking on it and give it a different name. Let's call this one left, for example. Alternatively, we can select several loudspeakers at once and change all their names in one go. You can see that Armonia Plus will automatically assign progressive numbers to each loudspeaker. And one last thing, we can also change the name of the array groups simply by clicking on the existing name and typing in a new one. And done! This is how we can easily add loudspeakers to the workspace. If you have any questions about this or any other videos in the series, please feel free to contact us on support.audio at powersoft.com.